All right guys, today we're installing this rear bumper and hitch kit from John Deere. And there's the part number. And we're stinking it on my lawnmower, which is a, I'm not even sure. I think it's a 335. Yeah, there you go. It's a 335E. Doesn't come with a towing hitch, believe it or not. And it's like a $3,000 machine, right? It's crazy times. So I bought this kit for it. It should be super, super simple. These two brackets, one on each side. Then this rear bar goes into these two holes, I believe. And then the actual hitch itself uh, goes to these four mountain points. And I, they got the torque specs in here too. I think it's 30, no, 41 and 21. Uh, and they show it here with the wheel off. So I'm not sure if you have to pull the wheel or not. I, I, I don't think so. I think you can probably sneak your hand in there and get it done. Uh, but yeah, here we go. All right, this is the right-hand side. And looking at the picture, you want this curved piece facing downward. And it looks like this tucks up in underneath. Uh, and you need two of the, I think they're 15 mil nuts. Uh, I think that's what they were. And it's pretty tight looking back here. I'll show you guys. Hopefully it doesn't get washed out. I don't know. It's kind of bright out there. But there, there's the two holes that you need to line this up to. Uh, I'm going to put one of the bolts in here first. And then see if we can sneak it in. Oh, without dropping the bolt. Yeah, there you go. So that front one's in. Get this guy. This guy. That guy in. And they just put the nuts on it. And these are torqued to 41 Newton meters. Uh, so yeah, it doesn't look like you need to take that wheel off. Oh, I might have to move you guys a little bit just to get up in here. Yeah, I don't see how I'm getting a torque wrench in there, but that's okay. So yeah, there you go. That's it. We just now need to torque that um, uh, and do the same on the other side. So I'll bring you back when that's done. So 41.2. So just do that on all four volts. All right, next up is putting the hitch onto the bar. Uh, it's pretty, pretty simple. Uh, there's four smaller bolts in the kit. That's what you want to use. Bring it up from behind and they want you to install these with the bolt from this side. Just put two in to get us started here. And these are 27 uh, Newton meters. And you'll want a spanner for the other side up too, right? So you don't have the square ends on the inside of them. They're 13 mils, so you're gonna need a 13 mil spire. Let me grab one. All right, we got our 13 mil and our torque wrench, and these little guys are 27 uh, Newton meters. Now you could do it on, it would be easier. All right. 
right, so you want 41, ooh, focus, oh, that's not good. 41 uh, Newton meters, same as the first two, and you cannot get the torque wrench on the one that's way in there, uh, but it, it does fit in that first one there. I think I showed that. Uh, so you got four more bolts. Um, yeah, this is a pretty simple install. Yeah, I did look online to see if anybody else had, uh, had made a video in this. I didn't find one. Uh, normally, I, when I look stuff up and I see other people have made videos, I just don't bother. Oh. But I figured since nobody had, I'd, I'd just shoot a quick video. I haven't made a video in a long time. So, that mainly because I haven't been working on cars. It's, they're too expensive right now. Even the damaged ones are just selling for stupid money. So yeah, that's why I haven't been doing anything. But yeah, there's nothing to this if you're doing it. job really That's it. Um, that's a really easy install. I, I think I've been out here probably 10 or 12 minutes. That's about it. Uh, yeah, I just need this for the dethatcher and then I have a, a, a tow behind uh, sprayer where I can spray the weeds. Um, so yeah, What's it? I think it's rated for uh, 100 pounds for the tongue and 250 is what it'll pull. So I think it came with some stickers too. Yeah, so you can put these stickers on if you want. That's the tongue weight in Newton meters, Spanish, yeah. So yeah, that's it, pretty easy job. Uh, you don't really need a torque wrench. I just did it because I had the specs. I didn't have to look them up. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's it. Uh, yeah, easy job. There you go, guys.